Hi, it's Erin. Today I'm going to do a quick demo and my honest review of this space SERP. Wait, another AI? But it caught my eye because collect real-time search results and monitor your brand or product mentions. That's what it says. So I wanted to try out for my business. When you log into the software or the website, spacesurp.com, you're going to find the, the main page is API playground. This website is very simple. As you can see, it's a playground, automation, searches, usage, and credits. And that's all you need. When you click on your login ID or your address, email address, you can check subscription, API, usage, support center, and the sign out. Very simple. There's nothing complicating in this website. I'm doing the website design for my local business owners. So I will say website design and the location is going to be Ellicott City, Maryland, the United States, because I do the local business and the period is going to be all time. And I'm going to choose organic results. Results of format is going to be JSON. You can choose the CSV file if you want to download to your computer. The device is going to be desktop and mobile. So I'm going to choose that. Um, when I first time used it, actually, it was a little confused on this part, page size and page number. The page size means that you get how many websites. Page number is the Google page. If you leave a blank on this here, then it's going to be default one. But if you say two, that you are going to scrap the website rank from page two on Google. So I would just say page number as one with 30 page size. So when you're done filling out all this part that I'll hit send and within a few seconds, you are going to get the result. So as you can see, I have position number one on Google. The first one's Wix.com and the last one position 30, which is this website here, allwords.com. This is the website link. This is their title and this is their description. When you click it, it will show the entire of their description. Now you started with the position number one, which is it's the very first website it shows on Google. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch JSON to CSV file and then I'll say only 10. No, actually I'll say just 30 and the page number is going to be three and hit send. I have more results here. So it starts from the Google page number three. I see blue host.com, BigCommerce, Indeed, ThemeForest, and so on with this keyword right here, website design. Now you can save results and download it to your computer. You can also save search by clicking save search and on the top right. The name is going to be website design and page 30 and page number is going to be three. So I would just hit OK. So when you go to searches on the top, this is where you saved. So you can go ahead and click on action. You're going to see the results here. On the automation page, you can go ahead and click this create automation. The automation name is going to be website design. Searches are going to be the one that I just saved. Interval, I'll need only weekly or in the monthly. They have a week, I'll say Monday. Start time, puppets, email message or the webhook integration. So I'll say email message, CSV file, and there's a button you can save create now you just created you are going to receive an email from the space serp every week for the results you can click on the three dots to stop automation edit or delete when you go to the usage you can find all your query type details cost how many credits you used and the date if you want to see the credits it's on the top here this space SERP will give you the real time search results on Google with your keywords. So you can type on anything, your website name or any keywords you're trying to target, do the research or finding the content to write or making a videos. You can also check what these websites used for their title and the description to rank better on your website or your client's website. When you go to the Google and then typing on the website design, then I found this result. I can see advertisements on the top and the first page is Wix.com that I showed you from the SERP, Spaces SERP website. And we have maps, we have images, videos, another ad. So it's kind of hard to find the organic results with this Google.com website. So when I was researching on this, actually the, my page size was a 30 and also the page number was three. 
Do you remember that? I think it was a three, right? <laughs> so I found the Bluehost here, which is the page number three on Google. Under these ads, this is the website it shows on page three on Google. I think it's pretty much useful when you research on the keywords, the website, and the mentions of your business name. So now Space Surf is only $59 one time cost, and you can do the search 15,000 searches per month. If you're not searching a lot, then 15,000 searches per month, it's, I think it's good enough. But if you are running the business and trying to provide some services to your clients, then you can stack more codes to have more searches per month. Hopefully you understand about the space SERP, how to use it. If you have any questions about the space SERP, you can leave a comment right below because I'm going to use it. But I'm not a tech person. So if you ask me any technical, something complex, question I'm not the right person to ask when you log in then you can find the chat button on here or if you have not purchased yet you can go to this deal website this is a question section you can ask any questions you want about this software and you can read the review by clicking reviews here before I purchased this software actually I read some of the reviews so that's why I wanted to try out how it's beneficial to my business please subscribe to my channel to watch my other review videos